Filming on location in all weathers can be a lot less romantic than it sounds. But when the technicians are school kids and the filming is done in lesson time, then who's grumbling? The location is Walton on the Nays, Essex, and the filmmakers come from the local county secondary school. Filming fits quite naturally into the school curriculum. Scripting, for example, being basically an exercise in composition. One of the stories is chosen, broken down into sequences, and each scene given to different groups for scripting. The success of a production depends not only on good photographs or the script, but on the back room boys, the props department, for example. Everything the unit needs in this field is made at the school by the woodwork class. If the script calls for a box, it's not good enough to produce just any old container. It's points like this that raise the standard here, way above that of many adult amateur groups. Similarly, the wardrobe department incorporates dressmaking, and for some productions, the costumes are quite ingenious. The school's first film was a comedy thriller, but as their technique improved, they turned their attention to documentaries and even cartoons, which involved thousands of separate drawings. One of the most notable achievements in this sphere was a road safety film featuring their own character, Demon Dan. In all cartoon work, of course, each drawing has to be separately photographed. In this case, one frame of film per subject. On location again, the unit is supervised, but not directed, by a master, Mr. L.F. Broom, who instigated the whole project. Now let's watch the drama unfold. Scene 19, take three. Action. At this rate, it won't be long before the school goes in for 3D, cinema scope, even smellies. That's where the chemistry class comes in. Then Hollywood had better look to its laurels. From Essex to Surrey.